name is Erin Klicka, and I'm a volunteer with the Association for Public Art. Today I'm going to help you find Martin Purrier's Pavilion in the Trees. Martin Purrier is an internationally acclaimed artist that has exhibited works all over the world. We're so fortunate to have a work of his right here in Philadelphia. This hidden gem was constructed in 1993 as a part of the form and function program of the Fairmount Park Art Association, now the Association for Public Art. Artists were invited to propose public art projects for Philadelphia that would be useful and used. Pavilion in the Trees is located in the Lansdowne Glen of West Fairmount Park. This part of the park is near the Japanese House and the Horticulture Center. Purrier was inspired by a universal childhood longing for a tree house. It's a great place to go if you're looking for a bird's eye view. Today we drove to the Japanese House. To enter the Horticulture Center grounds, come in through the Montgomery Drive entrance. Once you're here, it's only a short walk to Pavilion in the Trees, but if you don't have a car, bus routes 38, 40, 43, and 64 will take you close to West Fairmount Park, as will the number 10 and 15 trolleys. Click here for a downloadable map of bike routes. The best place to park is at the parking lot near the Japanese house off of Lansdowne Drive. Pavilion in the Trees is only a short walk from here and parking is free. After parking, head east with the Japanese house on your right. After passing the Japanese house, cross the crosswalk and take the footpath to the right. The path will fork again. Take the sharp right down the hill over the small bridge. After crossing the bridge, take your first left up the hill towards the wooded area. As you walk, there will be a fence to your right, and the path will turn to dirt ahead. Don't be alarmed if you feel lost. Some artworks are meant to be discovered, and you're almost there. Continue straight. Pavilion in the Trees is approximately 20 feet ahead of you. We've arrived! It's time to sit back, relax, and enjoy nature's surroundings. Thanks for watching! I hope this video was helpful and will encourage you to visit Martin Purrier's Pavilion in the Trees. If you need help finding other sculptures in the Philadelphia area, visit the Art Association's Museum Without Walls website at museumwithoutwallsaudio.org or visit our YouTube channel. Brought to you by the Association for Public Art. The Association for Public Art is the nation's first private nonprofit organization dedicated to integrating public art and urban planning. Founded in 1872, APA commissions, preserves, and interprets public art in Philadelphia. To learn more about us, visit our website at associationforpublicart.org or like us on Facebook.